So this is how to use cheaper cash to pay for stuffs on aliexpress.com. So if you want to pay for stuffs on um, AliExpress, let's say you want to buy something on AliExpress and your Naira card doesn't work, you can use cheaper cash to do this. So in this video, I want to show you how to do it, the easy way to do it. The first step is to have a cheaper cash dollar card and you need to um, create an account with cheaper cash and then create a dollar card. So after creating a dollar card, you need to fund the dollar card with the total amount that you want to use to buy stuffs on AliExpress. So let's say you want to buy an item for $100 on AliExpress, you want to do the mass and to do the mass, you want to first come to cheaper cash and come here, click on convert and then you want to see how much cheaper cash is charging for dollar on that day. So the are rates currently today that I'm making this video is 1775 so that should be if you want to do hundred dollars you have to multiply it by this and you get how much you send in Naira all right so you have a bank account here a Naira bank account and you want to send the Naira here all right so after sending the Naira there you come to it again you come to this convert and you want to convert the naira to us dollars so now you have us dollars you come to card here so you should have created your dollar card by now so if you've not created it you need to create it i have a video on how to create it just um you can watch that video if you want to but if you've created the card you come here you click on top up and you can top up this card so you can equally top it top with your naira directly and it's basically the same thing as topping it up to as converting it to dollars initially so you can use any one you want if you convert it to dollar initially the dollar will appear here if you want to use naira directly you can just use naira directly and then you add it all right so you add how much you want to um um fund so this this money is basically going to your card so you can click on top up and your card will be topped up all right so now let's we have topped up our card so hi um we let's say we have hundred dollars on this card it's going to show right here so what you need to do now is to get the card details so you come here where it says show card details you click on it and you are going to see the card details so it, it's going to show you the card name the card number, the expiry date, and the CVV. So all you have to do now is copy it. All right, you copy it and then you want to go to AliExpress. All right, so you come to AliExpress and you select what you want to buy. Let's say I want to buy this um, tab here. I select the tab I want to buy. So I add it to my cart and then I click on buy now. So. I've selected everything I want to, to buy. So what I'm going to do is if I come here where I have this payment method, I want to click on it and I want to change the payment method. So I basically come here, click on here where it says add a new card and I add a card from cheaper cash and then I change the name. I put the month and then I put the CVV and I click on save and confirm. So the moment it saves, I can now proceed to make the payment. So this is how you basically use cheaper cash to pay for things on um, AliExpress.com. It's important to note that anytime you use cheaper cash to make a transaction and your transaction fails because you don't have money, they are going to charge you some money. And after some time, they might even disable your card. So do not save this card on aliexpress just use it only when you want to use it and fund it because if you if you use it to pay for stuff either by mistake and the transaction fails because you don't have enough money on the card they will charge you for the failed transfers the failed transactions and they are going to equally delete your card you know cheaper cash is notorious with charges so make sure to use this information um, wisely. 
I hope this video helps you like the video subscribe i'll see you in my next videos bye bye